put together this little buggy that enables me to create some smooth panning shots. It also allows you to pan round something uh, on a curve. So it's uh, built out of Lego Technic, namely the Lego Mindstorms set. Uh, the motors aren't actually powered. They're there to help with resistance on uh, moving the wheels around. So I'll show you that in a second. But the general idea is that you'd line up your shot and then you'd be able to do a smooth roll past something. And if we turn the wheels in on each side, then that allows you to come round it, giving some quite interesting shots uh, for something like your B-roll. So this works pretty well so far. I've been quite pleased with it. So let's have a look at how this is put together. If we kind of ignore the motors for now. Um, so we've got our wheels and just a, a structure here for the camera to sit on. Um, there's not much to that. And then the wheels, you can turn them like that and you can kind of hear the motor is providing some of that resistance. Without it, uh, these wheels just flop all over the place. Um, and were quite difficult to set to the position that you wanted them. It's all right if you want to do a straight line, but like I say, if you want to curve it inwards like this, so it follows it on a curve like that, um, keeping those wheels aligned was difficult without the motors here. So I've got the motors uh, there purely for the resistance. And then when you've set where you want the, uh, the wheels to go, it generally stays where it's supposed to. And there's a fair degree of movement in there, so you can do quite a tight curve if you want to. So I'll see if I can put some plans for this up online. But I think you can kind of get the general gist of it just by even having a quick look at this. Uh, I don't know if there's a nice Lego diagramming tool where you can uh, put these things together. Let me know in the comments if you know of one. Well, I'm going to go searching afterwards and see what I can find. If I do find a way to uh, share the design, then I'll put it in the description of the video. Anyway, I hope this helps for anybody that's trying to do something similar and uh, hopefully the results from this, you can see those in my other videos uh, and hopefully they'll look all right. Anyway, thanks for watching. See you next time.